It's Drew with you with Wake Up Tahoe, and we wake up early and get the show started super early in the morning, so what do we do? We gotta start with a good, healthy breakfast. So today, I'm gonna show you how to make the Wake Up Tahoe with Drew Murin cupcake, which is the way to start your day. First of all, what you're gonna need, good, good old fashioned tunes. Here we go. Damn it. <laughs> now that we got that, first thing we do, one of these bowls, dollar, Rite Aid. Next thing you need, brownie pack. Easy done. Preheat oven, done. Mix, done. Rip it open, there you go. Pour this over there, like that. All you need is get a cup to open up like this, throw it in the bowl. Next thing you're gonna need is some of this oil right here. That's why you have this holster right here, see? You carry all your devices with you in your holster. A little bit of oil. Done. Easy as that. Oil, not so bad for you, as long as it's canola oil, vegetable oil, you know, whatever. All the time. We're all going to die eventually, basically. Then you need water. You know, cleanup is always something you should wait for afterwards. So now you take that, you're done with water. Now what you got to do, pound it a few times, get it all mixed up. Then, you're lucky they'll stir it off. We're shaking it up, stir it up, get it nice and, see what I mean? See that? That's what you're looking for. Keep stirring, keep stirring. If you're a clean baker, that's obviously an issue. It obviously doesn't know, you don't know what you're doing. You never trust a skinny cook, bottom line. All right, this is what keeps the crew going in the mornings. We get this all mixed up. Nice. You gotta like, oh yeah, see it's how it's starting to ball up. Perfect. That's done. Put that aside. Next, you're gonna need eggs. Two of these babies. You always put those in there. Make sure there's no chicken in it. Make sure they don't smell funny. That's always a bad thing. There you go, two of those. There you go. Now you're getting that equal consistency that Martha Stewart dies for. Mix it all up. You can use a power tool if you'd like. I recommend like a DeWalt drill with a kind of whisker attached to the end. It gets things done a lot faster, but for those of you interested in a little bit of a workout, here's some switch arms. Okay, man, we're dexterous. Now you're good. See that? That's what you're looking for. Done. Eggs, done. Next you need one of these things. I just learned the other day, this is called a cupcake tin. They come in multiple different sizes. Whatever. I'm gonna only make half the pan because that's just the way to roll. Oreo cookies. Try not to do what we did and eat half of them on the way home from the store. It really doesn't help with the whole process. But what you gotta do, take one out. Jif. By the way, make sure to take in your omega-3. It's good for the heart, good for the brain, helps you out. Slap a little peanut butter on each side. Drop it in the pan. Nothing like a little sweet, a little healthy food in the morning to make you think clearly. You know, TV show hosts, it's not an easy job. You got people yelling at you. You got producers always saying, oh, you know, you forgot this, you forgot that. Well, you know, I'm just one man. All right, so after you get this peanut butter, plenty of omegas in there. I don't know how they, it doesn't smell like fish. How can it be omega-3? Anyway, that's done. Now, that's the significant part right there. You're almost done here. This is how easy it is. Always remember to cook comfortable. I recommend boxer shorts and a uh, and an apron, but you know, use your own discretion. Now what you're gonna do is watch this part. This part's always tough. You should always taste it first too. Make sure it's cooked. All right. Pour it on the top. Pour it on the top, just like Martha Stewart would do. Make sure to keep it all inside the pan. Don't let it get on the outer edge of the pan because then it's hard to clean the pan. But, you know, you can always throw the pan away and just get a new pan. Just like that. Make sure. That's it. All right. All you got to do now, oven, 45 minutes. Make sure to use an easy-bake oven like I do. Picked it up when I was a little kid. You're ready to go. We'll be back with you in one hour.